And I'm Rusty Commissioner for Information, Sir Paul Wolves, who has inspected level of damages caused by flood and distributed relief materials to affected persons in Obaru local government area. The Commissioner was accompanied by the former Transition Committee Chairman of Obaru local government area, Ms. Sarinze Awogo, member of Anambra State Universal Basic Education Board, ASBEB, Dame Chinyere Mbakwe, among other stakeholders. Correspondent Faith Onyemuche reports. Communities in Obaru local government area are among the first hit by the flood due to their closeness to the river Niger. And since the rise of the flood, many have been trapped in their homes. Others have fled for safety to various internally displaced persons camps provided by the state government, while some unfortunate ones have lost their lives. Addressing people affected by the flood at their various IDP camps, the Information Commissioner said the state government is doing everything within its power to see that they are taken care of within the period the flood will last and after. Sir Paul, who is also from the local government area, said they have witnessed flood in previous years, but not in the present magnitude. He appealed to affluent citizens and good-spirited individuals to complement the efforts of the state government in giving support to the affected persons. <laughs> You know, anya ma abalo boda anya so. It's just that ijunka is the excess. Asi mo nyo abuna die. No generator anya from if I na ano. Nya bi jugata anya bi do kwabi bendo anya tu aisi abe. On their parts, Mr. Wogo and Dame Mbakwe appreciated the commissioner for their visit and relief materials distributed to the people. They encouraged the people affected by the flood to be strong and receive help given to them in good faith, pointing out that flood is a natural disaster that did not only hit Obaru local government area, but Nigeria in general. Some of the affected persons who spoke to ABS said they were relieved seeing the commissioner adding that the support from the state government have also been encouraging. They, however, called on both the federal and state governments to find lasting solutions to the challenge. So, Among the relief materials distributed by the commissioner were food items, cash, and life jackets. From Obaro, local government area, Faith Onyemuche, ABS News.